Meet Bassett's Joe Ray. Some of the streets may know him by a different name. Ruthless Joe Ray. I'm a pressure cooker. Um, I wouldn't say straightforward, but I'm a very aggressive, very aggressive fighter. And I, I, I throw punches to hurt. I, I throw bad intentions. Never backing down, taking on all comers and um, going at them. You know, aggressive, my, my aggressive style. As everybody might know, I, I was a street fighter. And um, basically what I was doing that to get noticed and um, MMA, first I wanted to be a boxer, but then I figured I could use more weapons uh, in the cage doing MMA. And it just, you know, from wrestling to high school, it just came. He tells us that he's headed to Atlantic City for the big fight this weekend. My pro debut fight is on January 25th. That's next Friday. Um, and it'll be at Atlantic City, New Jersey at the Tropicana Casino. Um, being that it's my pro debut, um, the guy, it's, it's the other guy's pro debut as well. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm just looking forward to it. You know, the, the, the crowd aspect, the big crowd, huge crowd in Jersey. Um, he has a fan base there, so I know he's going to have a lot of support. And um, it's going to be very different. Ruthless Joe Ray has been going the extra mile getting ready. I study a lot of film. Um, I have done it in amateurs and I, I continue to do it in pro. I have a few videos on him. I've been watching him and uh, I'm very excited to fight him. He's an aggressive fighter and uh, I like to fight those kind. They're easy to uh, catch with the punches. The bigger venues, meeting new people, meeting new fighters. Uh, you watch fighters on TV, the next thing you know you're in the dressing room with them. So I'm very ecstatic about that. Mm -hmm. Ruthless tells us that he has gained a lot on the way, but the road to victory has not been easy. I can sum that up in one word, sacrifices. Um, you have to give up a lot of stuff to want to do this, you know, put all your energy and focus into it and uh, just, just a lot of sacrifices. You have to start eating right um, because you can't put a lot of junk in your body, you can't drink, you can't smoke. Um, you have to get up early to run in the mornings, you have to put in those training, those hours and hours of grueling training time. It's not always fun, but when you fight and get the, get the victory, you know, it's all, it's all worth it. You know, only fight inside the cage, uh, never out on the street anymore. And um, I like, it keeps me out of trouble. It's actually something that teaches discipline and, you know, dedication. And it uh, keeps me out of trouble, and I, I like it. Joe tells us that the fighting business is pretty big in Martinsville and Henry County. The problem is they're tired of fighting each other. The name of my team is Team Rock Bottom, and uh, I train with Jamo Lucas as the head trainer. It's actually a lot uh, through Bassett, Henry County area, and um, actually it's another school on 220. You know, it's actually it's actually real big and, and very popular around this area. It's just um, as far as to get, we don't all want to fight each other. You know, it, you know, it gets boring after a while. You know, fighting the same people. So venturing out it has become the the biggest thing to do. Um, but it is, it is very big in in this area. This is a fight town, believe it or not. Covering entertainment in Martin Luther County, Charles Rourke, Star News.